Dressing sharp does not equal wearing a suit. I don't know where this definition came about, but a suit is just a particular outfit. And there are many times that, Hey, you don't want to wear a suit. It's hot. It's the wrong occasion. It's not what, it's not what you want to wear. Now there are occasions when you do need to wear a suit. You're applying for a job and everyone at the company wears suits. That makes sense. But a lot of times you simply want to put your best foot forward and you don't want to wear a suit. So how to look sharp without wearing a suit. Gentlemen, that is the subject of today's video. Tip number one to looking sharp without a suit, gentlemen, is nail the fit. You've probably heard me say fit before. Fit, fit, fit. Fit is king. Know the name of your tailor. Take everything to get adjusted, including your casual clothing. There's nothing wrong with getting your jeans to fit a bit better. To taking every shirt in your casual and your dress wardrobe and getting it particularly brought in, maybe darted in on the sides, maybe buy the particular brand that's going to fit you right in the shoulders. But when you find a brand that works for you, when maybe you get clothing custom adjusted or or you get it custom built to fit your body type. You're going to find it just looks better. Tip number two to looking sharp without a suit gentlemen is to practice putting outfits together and wear them because what happens when you practice is you start to develop your go-to outfits. These go-to outfits you feel great in because you feel great in them. You become confident. I can tell you nothing is more attractive than a man who's confident in simply the clothing and how he represents himself. So you start off maybe with a bit of a stretch, maybe wearing a shirt of this color, of this style, of this design is a stretch for you. Then you go into shirts like this. Then you start going into shirts like this. And what you find is because you practice, you get stronger, you feel more confident in your style, your ability. And all of a sudden you're leaving the jackets, the suits at home, and you're able to look great in something that maybe a year ago you wouldn't have had the courage to wear. Tip number three, accessorize with authority. There's this great quote with Jack Nicholson and they asked Jack, why do you wear your sunglasses all the time? Are you sensitive to the light? What's going on? He says, when I wear my shades, I'm Jack Nicholson. Without them, I'm a balding 60 year old man. And I like that quote because it's funny, but I also like it because what it does is it stresses that even Jack Nicholson wanted to have a signature accessory, a signature piece that people, when they saw him, they knew that's Jack. I can recognize him. You can develop this. You can have a signature piece that is go to for you. Maybe not sunglasses, but maybe a hat, maybe, you know, very functional for the hotter areas of the country or the world. Maybe it's going to be a bracelet, beads. Maybe it's going to be jewelry. Maybe it's going to be a necklace. It could be as something as timeless and simple as a watch, which by the way, this watch from Vincero guys, they're the paid sponsor of this video. I'm going to link to them down in the description for over a year. I've been working with Vincero and what I love about Vincero, their watches are beautiful. I mean, I look at this watch right here and this is a great looking watch. I've received compliments on it. All right, guys. So as you go through the Vincero website, what you'll notice is that Vincero makes bold designs for guys that want to set themselves apart at an affordable price. Guys, look at these beautiful watches. When you're wearing something like this, it is not going to be confused with another brand. These definitely stand apart. Look at the bold colors. Look at the bold designs. They look like something that could cost 10 times what they're going for. Look at the spec details, 316 L surgical grade stainless steel, the Citizen Moyota quartz movement, the sapphire coated mineral glass, basically it's scratch resistant, the luminous hands, the genuine Italian leather band, the dimensions on the watch is about 43 millimeters in diameter, thickness is about 10.5 millimeters. Gentlemen, I'm going to link to Vincero down in the description. Go use that discount code RMRS and you get 15% off anything you purchase. Guys, great company, fully support them. Go check them out. Tip number four to look sharp without a suit. Don't wear a suit jacket, but still wear a jacket of some kind. There are a wide variety of jackets out there. So this jacket right here, this is what you typically think of in a suit jacket. So a solid navy blue, maybe dark charcoal gray or a black, but all of a sudden you start to bring in colors like this. This is a sports jacket and great thing about a sports jacket. It builds up your shoulders leans up your midsection, makes you look taller. You can bring in colors like this on a pocket square. And for a lot of guys, this is going to be a great step. These are not suits. 
Suits are jackets and trousers made from the same fabric. Sports jackets are made from their own fabric, not with a particular uh, pair of trousers and oftentimes bolder fabrics, bolder patterns, and I think can go great with dark colored denim. You can wear them with a wide variety of odd trousers and they even come in more casual builds. This one is made from cotton, a very tough build right here. I could actually wear this to a job site if I was an engineer. You can even go for a denim jacket. Yes, a denim jacket I would put in this, not in the same level of formality, but it's much more casual. Again, you're going to get something that's going to trim up your midsection, make you look a little bit taller, lean up your silhouette by creating a monochromatic look. Look at this jacket I'm wearing. You can wear leather jackets. You can wear suede jackets. All this does is it just makes you look stronger, more masculine. And there are certain fabrics like leather and suede that actually have a very masculine feel to them. Tip number five to looking sharp without a suit, gentlemen, is to bring in the vest, particularly to bring in the odd vest. An odd vest is a vest that is made to stand on its own. It's made individually. They're usually made a little bit longer. They're also made of higher quality and with fabrics, they're going to be a little bit louder, a little bit more attention grabbing. And that's why I like them because you can wear this with denim. You can wear it with a dark, you know, pair of slacks. And when you wear this over a dress shirt, it can bring the, it, very similar to a jacket. It can trim you up a bit. It can build up the arms, especially if you take care of your chest and your arm area, you work out quite a it, it can really allow you to show that part of your body off. Tip number six to looking sharp without a suit, gentlemen, is to take your grooming from good to great. How to do that? Small improvements, guys. Just simply look at yourself in the mirror and say, you know, have I been rocking the same hairstyle for two years? Ever since I got out of the military, I know I was guilty of wearing short hair all the time. I just liked it. It was easy to take care of, but really I was used to it. I started doing different things with it. I started using different hair products. Uh, there are many, if you want, maybe you've got something that doesn't have any shine. Maybe go for a shinier look, go from a gel, maybe to a paste. Try the different things out there and really experiment with your hair. Then look at your face. All of a sudden, hey, can I actually maybe try growing a beard? Maybe you've already grown a beard, but you want to trim it differently. Pay attention to the small details, the outline here around the neck. So, what this does is when people see you pay all this attention to the grooming details, they're going to look at other details like your shoes, like the way that you've put yourself together and it's going to help to highlight your entire overall style. Looking sharp without a suit, tip number seven. Look to take your footwear up to the next level. One of the easiest things you can do is look at what you're already wearing and look to go up a higher level of quality. So, if you already wear work boots, why not wear a dress boot that actually is very classic in design, is made from a higher quality leather, can be resold, uses really just, just a beautiful looking boot that you can wear casually. Maybe you work in a very conservative company and they really, you want to keep things really simple. Well, why not going for a two-tone, a very muted two-tone overall, but something that it's not going to grab attention. But when people see that, especially people in the know, they're like, wow, he's got a little bit of style. I like what he's doing within the limitations of the company. But I do think that if you take your footwear to the next level, it's an easy way to upgrade your style and you don't even have to wear a suit. Tip number eight for looking sharp without a suit, gentlemen, is to bring color into your wardrobe. So, most of us when it comes to dress shirts, we've got the blues and the whites and I think that these are great for setting your foundation, but then we get stuck there and we never think to bring in any color. If you've got your base shirts down and they fit you great and everything else you've nailed, look to start experimenting and having fun with color. There's nothing wrong with a man actually bringing pink into his wardrobe. Lavender and variations of that I think is another great combination. This one actually has a little bit of a herringbone pattern in there. For those of you that are in a very casual environment, you start to bring in patterns like this that also have a purplish and a blue in it. And you don't have to keep it to the shirts, guys. Talking about those jackets, you can bring in a simple pocket square. You can bring it into your necktie. You can even have it with a contrasting in your shoes. The point I want to make, gentlemen, is that color is underused in men's wardrobes. If you can find a way to bring in just a little bit of color into some of your favorite outfits, it's going to help you stand out from the pack. Tip number nine for looking sharp without a suit, gentlemen, take your bag game to the next level. So, you want to invest in something that is going to stand up to the test of time, get better with age and something that you can spend once, maybe cry about because the price was high, but over time it actually gets better. This is something that goes with you as you travel and you journey throughout life. A bag, you know, like this right here. So, a leather bag like this, when you're carrying this to the airport, it's something that, you know, it just gets better and better with time, something you would pass on to your son. Maybe you are a man who's on the road two to three days a week traveling in and out of your car. This would be a great bag. Find the right bag for you and then invest in quality. 
Tip 10 for looking sharp without a suit, gentlemen, is to make sure everything in your wardrobe, you love it. Because what you don't want to have is a wardrobe full of items that you're uh, about. What you want to have is a much smaller wardrobe that, yeah, every single item in there, when I put it on, I feel great. Because then it doesn't have to be a suit and you're going to look sharp, you're going to look great, you're going to feel great, and you're going to be confident. All right, gentlemen, now it's your turn. I want to hear from you down in the comments. What did you think of this video? What could I have done to make it better? And if any of you guys would like a watch from Vincero, make sure to go check out their website. Put down in the description the specific model, the specific color, the specific style, and why it would work for you. I've got a couple extras and the Vincero discount code. Don't forget to use it. Great company, great watch. I've worked with them for well over a year, and I really appreciate you guys supporting my sponsors, supporting all the companies. I work with because this is, it's just enabled me to create some great content I feel here at Roman Real Style and I thank you. That's it guys. Take care. I'll see you in the next video.